Dear students, in this video, I am going to discuss about five major difference between old and new B.Sc. Nursing syllabus. First difference is that from this year onwards, semester system is followed. Semester means one semester means 26 weeks or 6 months. It includes holiday one week, vacation one week, exam and preparatory holidays for four weeks. Total 26 weeks. And the second difference is that there are certain modules to be completed in the syllabus. First one is a mandatory module and the second one is an elective module. Mandatory modules are must that should be completed by all the students. That is mandatory for all. They are outlined by the council and it includes certain topics like first aid, health assessment, BCLS. There are many topics which that must be taken by all the students. All must complete such modules. And the second one is an elective module. There are options and choices for elective modules for example a candidate has to complete one module by the end of the fourth semester and there are three modules available out of the three they have to select one for example before fourth semester they have to complete any of the three modules which are human values diabetic care or soft skills any of the any one of the module has to be completed by the student before the end of the fourth semester. That is the elective module. For elective modules, there is choice and for mandatory modules are must as part of the course. Third difference is the credit system. One credit means... 20 hours for theory for practicals one credit means 40 hours for clinical one credit means 80 hours for elective courses one credit means 20 hours so if you complete 80 hours of clinicals you will get one credit if you uh, complete 20 hours of any elective course you will get one credit like that there is credit system is followed from this year onwards Regarding examination, a candidate have to complete 80% of attendance in each of the theories and 100% of attendance in each of the practical area before the award of degree. And the candidate must acquire 50% of mark for internal assessment in theory and practicals to be eligible for university exam. And the minimum pass mark shall be 40% for communicative English and elective modules and all university examination has to be cleared before appearing for 5th and 7th semester examination. There is no additional supplementary examination. Supplementary examination shall be conducted along with the end semester university exam only. Candidate should clear all previous examination before appearing for final semester. And another difference is for university practical, you have OSCE for 15 marks and direct absurd patient for 35 marks. So OSCE is also included for practical examination from this year onwards. That is a major difference. And the final point is grading of performance so now you don't have a first class distinction or second class based on the percentage of marks you have grade points and a grade is awarded O means outstanding and 100 percentage of marks if you get you will be outstanding and the grade point is 10 if you have 90 to 99.99 99 percentage you, you are excellent that is A plus grade point is 9 if you have 80 to 89.99 percentage you are very good A is awarded very good grade point is 8 if you have 70 to 79.99 percentage the grade point is 7 and you are B plus that is good for nursing courses and other courses pass is at C grade that is 50 percentage and above marks you need 
B means above average and the percentage of mark is 60 to 69.99 percentage and the grade point is 6, 6 and average is C. Grade point is 5 and the percentage of marks is 50 to 59.99 percentage. P for pass, grade point is 4 and the percentage of mark is 40.49.99 percentage and fail means F. Grade point is 0 for English and other elective subjects pass is at P grade 40 percentage and above. Mr. At the end of the course, semester grade point average and cumulative grade point average will be computed and it will be indicated in the transcript and mark list showing grades of all semesters and all their courses and subjects rather than the uh, marks and the classes, distinction, rank, etc. So that is a major difference. Thanks for patient li listening. If you are seeing the channel for first time, please subscribe the channel.